Just gotta keep our cool. Be smart about this. Smart? Are you joking? We made too much noise once again. Dutch made too much noise. To us? Dutch made I mean, too much noise. It wasn't me. We killed the past few weeks. Far too many. It's Dutch playing his games. Jose too. Get involved with those two families. It was a terrible idea. Con men working their magic. They also, I think I just took a tiny bit of damage. Well, not me. Uh, George took a tiny bit of damage. There was a lot of gold. Yeah, they thought there was money. Ain't there always? Look, Marston, I don't know what to tell you. Things don't always work out. That ain't nothing new. Jack's gone. We lost Sean, Mac, Davy, Jenny. And for what? We can't change what's done. We can only move on. But one day, we need to start learning from our mistakes. Oh, is that something you've Come done, John? On. It ain't all bad. We've had a rocky run. We'll be okay. We'll get through it. <laughs> Dutch will fix it. Dutch will come up with a big plan. Right now, every plan gets us into worse trouble. Yeah. We're getting further from where we're meant to be going. I agree hey, on can't that. Put all this on Dutch. You're worked up. And rightly so. I could put a lot of it on Dutch. Just don't get too far in your head with all this. You'll never get out. It's a goddamn mess. Mm. That poor kid. We chose this life. He didn't. I don't know. I think this life chose us. You, me, Dutch, Hosea. It's been a long time now. Sure has. Life's changed. I sometimes wonder if things was ever the way we remembered them. If we were ever who oh. we thought we was. Like I told you, don't go down a rabbit hole with this, Marston. That won't help nothing. I treated Jack bad. Abigail, too. Treated? Bitch, really? You spend the whole of the first game being an absolute cunt to them both. Carry on. I didn't want to believe he was mine. You know, when I was lost on that mountain after Blackwater, part of me thought... Alright. Should be just, just a down bit like... John's thing. a bit of a pain in the ass. She she just pisses just me off. About I could just leave again and no one would ever know. But some wolves thought otherwise. Look. So hang on, what? He was gonna. Sorry, it went a bit weird because we arrived then during that cut, uh, that 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 scripting. So it went a bit weird. But he was fucking off again, was he? When we went to rescue him from the wolves. Also, Micah, I would agree. Micah started a lot of shit. Um, as well. Which is annoying. Um. So yeah, it's not it's not all Dutch. I'll agree on that. But fucking hell. Um. Oh right. Also, uh, I did have a good Christmas. Fusion, thank you for asking. <laughs> oh, they were scouting for in the snow for a place to stay, and John got lost. That was it. Although I would say, once again, it's those two motherfuckers cocking it up for the rest of us. <sighs> now, in this spot we're going to, it's close to San Denis. As soon as we oh, get hello. the others safe, we'll find this. Bronte and get Jack back. So what is this place? Lenny found it. Big old run-down plantation house. It looks That's nice. It up ahead. Four walls and a roof. We're moving up in the world. You ain't seen inside it yet. Mm. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. Oh, this is where the moonshine fight was. Where I was Lenny sure was like, I'll go in. I ain't sure on nothing. Oh, uh, uh, right. excuse me. Let's leave Fuck. the horses here and take a look. Just smashing me with your horse? Do you mind? Fuck off! John, fuck off! Oh, speaking of it's naughty again. animals. What? Boys, Shit! Away. I'm not now! I've got a cat! She's at home. I can see that. Hello? You think there's Hang on, John. One moment, John. Just, uh, let me just prepare the de- uh, Have you gone again? How rude. She came in. She fucked off. Hello? Hello? What are you doing behind the green screen? Just pissing around. Oh, cats. Hello? Hello? What are you doing under the desk? Do you want to come on the desk? Come on 
my desk so I can play the game. <sighs> yes. Hello, good girl. Hi. <laughs> Four of them. I'll check the house. You keep watch out here. Okay. All right, we're going in. They've looted the outside bodies, which is a slight pain, but that's fine. Oh, it's Lemoyne Raiders! Hang on, let's get the proper guns out. The I'm going to be in close proximity to people. Bitch, I'm in the fucking house! What do you want from me? So I'm just seeing if there's anything. Merit. You fools should have left when you had the chance. Day. Oh, ah. hey. Oh, shit. <laughs> Is that TNT? Bitch, we're not blowing up the house. Holy shit. It's not your finest hat, but I'll take it. It's slightly better than the hat I had. Ooh, gun oil. What bloody hat is that? It's, uh, it's, uh, I used to be in a war. And now my hat is very fucked up. Uh, I would like to maintain you, please. Um, clean. Who sat on my face? Oh, there's no one offered. <laughs> no one offered to sit on Arthur's face. Maybe that's why he looks so fucked off. It is, yeah, it's a confederate hat. <coughs> one of the vets had it. I think earlier. We should probably maintain the pistol I'm using. Because, yeah. I mean, it's not actually that bad. Uh, clean. Also, right, I find that the whole cleaning uh, concept hilarious in light of how tedious the rest of the game is. Like, I'm cleaning a gun. Shouldn't I be breaking this whole thing apart to clean it? I'm putting a rod down the, the barrel to get the gun, like, I've cleaned guns. But then this doesn't do it, which feels a bit weird. Just That just suddenly occurred to me, like, they've simplified this. That's too far. I know. They simplified this. But heaven forbid. Like, I want to do anything else. Can you imagine? Like a Tetris-like gun assembling minigame. No, I've done that one. Have I done all of them? Get yeah, mid-combat. I'm just like, shit. Fuck! <laughs> Quick time events. That one's fine. Have I done all, f all, uh, all four? I think I've done the shotgun, haven't I? I'm just I want to be absolutely sure. Can you imagine if I, while I was dual wielding, it would be like it's slow enough when he has to reload both of them. Um, I think that's it. I don't think we have any other guns, do we? Apart from on the horse, so we're good. Put them back. Brilliant. Okay. Any more of you upstairs? I'm coming for you. You hear me? Come at me. I dare you. Come at me. You get the message last time. All right. Where are you creeps hiding? Come out where I can shoot you. I'm not hiding at all, buddy. If anything, I'm just leisurely strolling about. Hello. There we go. What a waste of time this dude was. Just mouthing off. Where's John anyway? Nothing there. 
there is a bit of... Oh, hello. Just suddenly jumping up there. Uh, there is a bit of dirty plate, though. Lovely. Oh. Oh. No, okay. Where is John? John! John, you piece of shit. You must be downstairs. Oh, no, can't go through there. That's fine. I knew you'd come. Oh, hello. Soon enough, you are some other coward like you. Me? Bish, don't you touch that gun. Fuck. The freedmen, the carpetbaggers, the army of criminals who stole our land and our government. I survived them all. All right, mate. Our fight will live on. Oh, oh no. I thought I was going to turn fast enough to get out of there, but no. Dude. Dude. I mean, he didn't even wait to find out what we wanted. We might have... I, I, it might have been fine. We could have done a deal with him. But no! I mean, to be fair, we did shoot everyone, so I suppose. Oh, a gold nugget. Also, I will say is, if we're going on the logic that these guys are all confederates based on this hat, then we've had a lot of... Oh, hello. We've had a lot of people who have gotten very salty about changes. Uh, I want to loot this. Oh, Jesus wept. There. Got him. That was not worth it. Fuck me. Okay. Jack's downstairs. Uh, no, Jack! You John is downstairs! Whoa! Fuck! Son of a bitch got me. Wasting my time. Oh. Well. I think that's a lie. I smacked a man. Didn't even have to shoot the last one. Good. Nice. Come help me with this, will you? <laughs> didn't have to. Didn't have to shoot the last one. Partially because I panicked and lost the control of the thing. <laughs> Can I just beat a man with my my fists? Yes, the Confederates were the slavery ones. If you want to, like, just very quickly gloss over the whole thing. Yes. Um, also, there's a cat paw. There. Oh, no, the cat paw has been removed. Uh. So, yeah. Um. Don't feel too bad about that raider dude. He's Here. had some, some issues. Give me a hand moving these bodies. Oh, what? I want the others walking into this. Follow me. All right. Where are we putting them? All right, this way. We'll dump the bodies in the swamp over there. All right, that's fair. Bye. Look. <laughs> okay, I can deal with the rest of the bodies. I know you can't. We'll meet up at the caravan. Guide them in. Oh God. Is this gonna? I really hope it speeds up because fucking hell. Three bodies. It's gonna take a while. <laughs> I like work from home. I mean, obviously, I work from home because um, it was a good. I, I feel personally it was a good choice because it's like, well, I play a lot of single player games anyway and always have. So, what's the point in renting office space, you know? It does, however, mean you have that weird thing of like, oh, I can get up whenever I want because I'm working from home. It's like, no, that's not how it works. Well, I'm quite lucky in that Cliff has fairly normal working hours, so it kind of forces me to be doing stuff versus um, both both of us like being stuck in a weird cycle. Although over Christmas there were some 2 a.m. bedtimes from uh, watching too much Ashens and things. Right. 
Let's try this again. We got fine living. Ignore the corpses and the alligators. It's paradise. I love it. Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, would you two kindly work your magic? Arthur, take a ride with me. Sure. Oh, God, not another one. George? Yes. Could I have a word with you? <clears throat> not now. Come on, Arthur. You've ignored Molly again. That could be a disaster. Can you believe that, girl? All I've got going on, and she wants to talk. Look. Everything okay with you two? If you're banging her, which I assume you are, because she lives in your fucking tent, then maybe, maybe have a chat. <laughs> maybe. I got far more important things to worry about right now than Molly O'Shea. So, so what? Where what if she gets going? really pissed off and turns you in? This eighth wonder of the civilized world, San Denis, I keep hearing about. According to the map, the road up this way should lead us right in there. Right. Okay. I guess this day ain't over yet. Not quite. Good work back there, Arthur. Everything went okay? A few loose ends. Nothing major. And John, oh my god, there it is. What you'd expect. I see some He's fucking boats. We are going to get that boy back. Whatever it takes. I need you to start asking around in the city for Bronte. Subtly, of course. Public places, maybe start with the saloons. Anyone mm -hmm. who can put us in contact with him. All right. Of course. What about the Pinkertons? I'm fairly sure nobody followed us. We moved out fast. We should be safe for a few days here. And then? I think we need to move a little further. Put some ocean between us and all of this. Oh. The mess with those two families. Losing Sean. I see things differently now. For a uh -huh. long time. I truly wow. believe the paradise lay somewhere in the west. I've got us. a bridge with blue paint on it. I just don't know anymore. Very posh. So also, hey Memphis. Maybe. I'm still thinking about it. Paints. Whatever we do, Ooh, steady. we'll need more money. In any case, we have more pressing matters to attend Ooh, to first. Oh, that is a fair point. Is it terrible that my first thought was she's pregnant? Could be. Could be. I mean, she tried to tell him, so maybe. That's a we'll see how it develops. Have I not been to this place yet? Uh, have I been to this place yet? No, this is the first time I left Saint-Denis until... Or Saint-Denis? Uh, or Saint-Denis! Um, until the game decides to take us here, because I thought, well, I'll just let it... First, it's just walking through here without fanfare. I thought I would let it um, do its thing. So, yeah, it's... Uh, oh, God, look at the pollution, lads. Oh, lovely. Oh, God. Oh, look at the oil! I mean, that's great. That is great attention to detail, like the fucking oil slicking on the water. But mm. okay, there she is, a real city, the future. Oh God, it's horrible. Big cities, they're always repellent. Exactly. Exactly. I'll find you in there. Go see what you can figure out. All right. Oh, it's horrible. It doesn't help that it's it's kind of grey and cloudy. Um, but I don't know if that's the night-day cycle, whether it's supposed to be like that. Either way, it's horrible. And it's also chapter four. Saint Dennis. Oh, it's a bit brighter now. Only a teeny bit. Teeny, teeny bit. And... There are three, it looks like. No, that's not what I wanted. New horses are available to purchase. Holy fuck. Um, so we've got to go around and ask about the three different Brontes. Angelo Bronte, see if, uh, see if any of these peeps know what's going on. That looks like the saloon. Oh, there's a couple of saloons. I suppose it is a big place. There's also a tailor! That really hurts.
hurt my face. We're going to the tailor first. I don't care what Dutch has to say. We're going to the tailor. I would also say we're going to the horse, the horseman, the stables. But um, can't be asked for that. You don't need new stuff. I'm very happy with the, I, George. There was a show on. Are there new guns? There's a gunsmith. A trapper. I suppose, yeah, so you can buy all the stuff you need. General store. There's a fence in town. Brilliant. Uh, is that a cinema? Theatre? Photo studio. Oh, my God. Can I get my photo taken? <gasps> Holy shit, son. We're going to the tailor and we're going to the photographer. <laughs> like... I, I was going to say, we probably need to change our clothes before, you know, we go do anything. Because it's, you know, we're not... We're, we look okay, but we could look better. We definitely need to have a wash. Is there a barber? We can get... Oh, my God. I might change his facial hair. Oh. Gab. Oh, my God. He's here as well. Oh, he's just vanished. Is it you? Hello? Ga Gavin's friend? Nigel. I think his name was Nigel. How do you do? Nigel, where did you go? Oh, he's there. Does he say the same shit? So we see. Oi. Good day. Warner. Please, tell me you've seen Gavin. I don't even know what he looks like. Big bloke. Cockney, Londoner. Hilarious. <laughs> oh, we've had such times, me and Gav. <laughs> no, sorry. I've yet to meet any hilarious Londoners. Oh, he's the best. <laughs> Gavin! Oh, Gav. Oh, I am so worried. And then he's going into his thing again. Gav! Sorry, mate. So, um, Gav. apparently... Get out of my way! Gav! Where are you? Where are you? Oh god, he's just walking alongside. I'm so sorry. Oh god, he's pushing me! Hang on, let's just... What are you doing? Fuck Howdy. you. Um... Yeah, he... Apparently, if you... It's either you kill him or you kill his friend. Not Gavin. You get a letter that suggests uh, Gavin! that Gavin and Gavin's friend might have done something naughty in a different country. Not entirely sure what. Um, Nigel, yes. You get a shady letter. However, we have to kill Nigel, and I'm not killing Nigel Thornbury. That is unacceptable. Oh, there's a stranger up here by the tailors. Holy shit. This is lovely, if a very grim. It feels like we're in Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Oh, hello. Oh. Hello? Someone wants to vote? Oh, there's a guard. Hello. Hey, folks. Ah. Where is she? Oh, hang on. She might be around here. Stranger. Hello, my dear. Oh, oh. dear. Ah, it might be Let her. Let me vote. Ah, hang on. Let me vote. Hello. You all right? Madam. Madam. You, my friend, what do you think about women's suffrage? Women voting? Sure, why not? Oh, why not? thank you, sir. You are a true progressive. No. Anyone dumb enough to want to vote, I say go for it. 
Oh, a cynic. How dull for you. Uh. I do hope you grow out of it, young man. It's so unappealing. Unappealing is what I do best. <sighs> Is this so that what this is the Mimi lady that everyone get uh, very upset about because someone decided to film themselves beating her up? to invade a woman's space like this. So bye, Crispy. Can't talk with her anymore. Oh well. So yeah, basically, uh, they kind of. Meant to be the land of liberty? They've kind of written her in, but also kind of written her to be a little bit overly aggressive about it. I don't know. I think, like, most of what she's saying is totally fine. I think it's the, the reaction that that individual probably did. I mean, his channel, yeah, was deleted, then restored. It's a difficult one, because... If it was self-defense, I couldn't give two shits. Um, also, yeah, it is a game, but... Bonjour. Oh! You know, bonjour. I forgot that there's French people here as well. More it's... Than us? Yeah. Because yeah. You keep us in gilded cages? I don't know. There was That was always going to be controversial, because it's a woman Hello. telling a man he's a okay. fucking idiot. Um, in not different words. Watch yourself. Or a cynic, or whatever. Um, yeah, like, the person who made it was aiming for a... A reaction yes, that is true that's the problem and but that then yeah then that's been taken as just being i don't know it's just i feel it's just kind of excuse me sir undermined the whole point of the thing of your time? hello yes all right can i tell you a little about what we're doing here sure less than a minute i promise uh yeah all right uh, we're trying to raise money to build an expansion to the Quincy Harris Memorial Hall, a shelter for homeless veterans and their families. Can you help? A donation of $20 would put us well on our way. You know what? Because I've got all the money, sure. I couldn't give a damn. $20 ain't no chicken feed, but sure, I can help you out. <gasps> That's mm. very kind. What is your name, sir? Arthur Morgan. Your donation will oh my be God, acknowledged on a founder's plaque when the building is completed. You have a great day, Mr. Morgan. I will, and you have a great day too. Well, good luck to you. Seems a worthwhile cause. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Oh, hello, there's Thanks. a tram! Bye! <laughs> Just like almost got hit by the fucking tram. Ugh. Yeah. How's the day treat? Yeah, I feel a bit. It's it's weird. Cause it's like I feel like yes, okay, there were suffragettes and they were at times quite aggressive. Yeah. Oh, didums. Hey, fellas. Evening, sir. Evening. Y'all doing all right? Oh, hang on. It's this dude. I've been covered in worse, friend. Just had to be me. To get shit thrown on your piss. Is that it? Okay, I guess I can't talk to you. Alright, fine. I'm gonna go back this way towards George. Yeah. I think the problem is it's a rock star game. And as soon as you try and put in stuff that's considered social justice or political commentary, everyone gets very upset. I think that's the issue. Bitch, really? I just gave you money. Find it in your heart to give to those who gave everything. Your donation will greatly improve the lives of our nation's heroes and their loved ones. Well, I gave I gave you money, Bish. I think the strangers in here are a bit bugged. They seem to sort of start and stop again. It's the same as Gavin's friend. I also probably wouldn't compare the KKK with women who Hello are wanting there. to be able to vote. But that's just me. You 
can't. That, that's the thing is, you've got like you can kill anyone in this because if you couldn't kill everyone and anyone, then um, it's, there would be some sort of unfair element to it all. Also, as I said before, if a bitch comes at me, it don't matter who they are, they're gonna get slapped in the face in this game. But yeah. Whoever's playing that trumpet, you keep playing. Can I tip you? Excuse no. me, Martin. Good evening, mister. Are you well? Just well. Okay. Evening. <laughs> Should I say evening to the trumpet man? He'll be able to reply. Hello. Sure. Hello. Hello. Yes, that is true in real life. Like, they say, yeah. But that's what any self-defense would teach you, is like... If your life is, you know... What is this dude doing? Oh, he was just like a cigarette. I was like, why are you walking around weirdly? Who can I talk to? Can I talk to you? Have a nice evening. Oh, no. Yes. I'm just in a friendly mood today for some reason. <laughs> no? Anybody? I'm just looking for some information. I think I need to be out here, really. Hello. Sorry about that. Hello. Have a good night, sir. I'm just going to go around upping my fucking rep by going, Hello. 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 Hang on a minute. Hello? What's this? <gasps> the brewery. Also, wasn't I going to go into uh, Duty Dad Dodd? Taylor. Taylor is that. I'm going back to the Taylor first. This is the problem with the big town. Is like, Especially with the strangers, they basically breadcrumbed me away from the Taylor. Which is silly, because I was going to spend good money at the tailors. I was going to buy a brand new outfit. You watch your fucking step, bish. Taking all that space up. Uh, no, I think we have to go... Hang on a minute, where's the front door? Might not be open. Bonjour. Bonjour to you too. Mind yourself. Hey, careful now. Bonjour. Did I walk past it? I mean, it could be closed. It is fucking night time. It's kind of hard. Oh, here. Here? Here? Dude! This door? Oh, yeah, no, they are open. Oh. No, Sorry, mister. My mistake. Please. Bish! No. What? You bastard. Oh, little fuck. Come on! What's your problem? I didn't do nothing. You stole a hundred dollars. I saw it. You little shit. This man's crazy. Money or your life. You choose. All right, all right. Damn it! You got me. Here. Mm-hmm. Do not run again. Oi! Oh hell! Should I need help? You do not need help. Give me my fucking money. Right, hog tying looting. Hold still, mister. Just a bit of cash, that's it. Fuck you. Holy hell. Just a bit of cash? Shit, you don't need to tie me up. Yes, I do, bish. I think this is mine. Guess they weren't lying. Come on. 300? Didn't he take 180? Did I just get more money back? <laughs> Goodbye, bish. Right, put the knife away. There we go. Ah, how the tables have turned. Right, I'm going to spend that money at the tailors. As soon as he bumped into me, and then it popped up. Like, my face. Just the outrage. Just the what? Underwear. Oh my god, they do underwear? Oh my god. Oh, wait until morning, yes.
New journal entry. Fuck! Please! Right. Let's try this again. Oh, God, I'm so sorry. Good day. Welcome. Hello. I'd like to browse the catalog. Let me see. Outfits. No. Uh, maybe? Not the Britannia. Oh, I can't. Why can't I get that one? Holy shit. Oh, improve my honor. Come now, don't doubt yourself. That looks excellent on you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. No. I mean, no. Who makes these outfits? Why is the hat so different? It's so no, it's yes. <laughs> I mean, that one looks like it's out of fucking GTA, doesn't it? Immediately. I get all sorts walking into this establishment, but they all end up looking better when they walk out. I can't actually buy that one because I haven't got the honour. This one looks like I'm going on a golf course. Doesn't it? In fact, there are variations, by the way. Oh, no, there aren't. That's a lie. Fuck it, we're going with this. Let's mix it up. Buy it. You have exceptional taste. I don't think I do. I'd like a hat. Is there a hat? Oh yes. <laughs> People around here come in just for those. Oh, there it is. There it is. <laughs> that is of the highest quality you can find. Thank you kindly, sir. Um, I bid you good day. Thanks. I have plenty more great items. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a man in the big city with my Thanks, big city hat. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, I'm going this way with my big city hat. It is a bit Jacob, isn't it? I mean, let's be honest. It's the same sort of time period. No, it's not. This is 18 something, isn't it? It's a bit more 90. No. No similar times. I like my boots, actually. I mainly bought them for the boots, which are ridiculous. Also, actually, the, the pinstriping is not quite as aggressive uh, once you're out the shop. I need a yeah, I do need a barber. That is correct. We need a nice moustache to go with our oh and there's the barber. And then we can go in. Oh! 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 Sorry, screw the out of you! Hang on! I got him! Here you go. Good grief. Uh okay, I might have bringing that one in you're welcome i think you may have just killed him though i think i've just witnessed uh, oh dear well that happened i didn't really think about it until i went through it and i was like hang on a minute i've just randomly hey, lassoed a black somewhere. dude and now the policeman is kicking him what have i done oh Right, Barber is... Oh, yeah, there we go. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi. Um, so what'll this, is, it be today? this is exciting and scary. Um, I, could you... I'd like to style it. Holy fuck. How long do I want it? Like a left parted fade. Maybe. I mean, there is also pomade. Pomade. I feel like we should go maybe a little bit shorter. Because it is getting a bit scruffy Man's now. Whiskers can make or break his whole deportment, you know. 
You won't get a part sharper than that. There we go. That's better, isn't it? <laughs> um, and then facial hair. Let's see what we got. So we have clean shaven. It's been a while. Flying fork. The English. Maltese. Burned side. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, goatee. The Jazar. Like a mutton. Pennant. That's pretty fancy. Apron. French fork. Forked Spartan. Thundreary. Oh, I quite like... I mean, if we needed a moustache. Presidential. Brigadier. Verdi isn't bad, I suppose. Picador, I think, is probably supposed to be what's-his-face. The Dali kind of moustache? God, there's loads. Hang on. Handlebar? Sure. Trim and distinguish. That's the handlebar look. You look ridiculous. I might just bring it in a bit. Mm, the mutton chops make the face strong and square. There we go. Thank you. It's alright, we're just okay. bringing it. Bring it all back down a little bit. Just, just to have a bit of a, a clear out. Although, there's a woman in the barber shop. Um, although, I am a bit annoyed about the moustache actually now. I might put it back to what it was. Yeah, it looks a bit too... Like, the problem you've got with it is, if you look directly above his moustache, he still has all the stubble. We like someone's someone's trends. not really cleaned that up um, on the the graphics front. It's fine at an angle, but if you look at it directly, you can see that there's it looks like he's really messed up. So I'm just going to go with the natural. Well, that's pretty decent. I might just maybe not that much. Put it to there. There we go. Ah, looking sharper than attack. Unlike your face. What the fuck happened to that? Also, your teeth. And where are your eyebrows, dude? Poor man. Uh, like Superman's moustache. Yes. That's what we're trying to avoid. Superman's motherfucking moustache. There we go. I look a lot better now. Although I do miss... I kind of miss the long hair, but it was getting a bit Micah level of disgusting. Micah and John level. It's a bit greasy. That's what something this game does not seem to do very well, at least on the PS4 Pro, is hair textures look awful. Right, I could have a bath as well. Good God, I could treat myself to so many things. But first, let's go in the saloon. Or the brewery. Oh, shit. Stick em up, cowboy. Are you kidding me, Dutch? I'm busy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, real funny, Dutch. Oh, I thought so. So... Here we are in a strange land of papists and rapists. America's very own Gamora. This city's all of the same to me. So, how you get yep. up? Children. I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. And from what I've heard, this establishment is our best lead, but I haven't had any joy in there so far. So, I should just give it a shot? I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me? Have you not seen my hat? I'll meet you back here in on. I'm the coolest motherfucker that's in here. Uh, what? hello? What's go- oh. I guess he's taking her to bed. Good day, everybody. Hello? I love how everybody has, uh, dead faces with varying moustaches on, and then the entire table just twitched. A bit weird. Dirty little French secret. <laughs> Thanks, Silence, for the resub. 29 months. Not unless Excuse we all get washed away. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> Oi! <coughs> excuse me. It ain't happened yet. No, I'm sorry. Please excuse me. I, I, I seem to have some very impatient customers. Bitch! Oh, now, fuck you! Can I help? You look like a whiskey man. Yes, I'll have a whiskey. Sure. Also, sorry I was grumpy. Dollar, please. I think the hat's gone to my whiskey? head. Oh, that's the real stuff. 
from a scout. Okay. Here, have one for yourself. Well, wow, thank you. There we go. So, mister, if I ask you a question, you ever hear of a fellow by the name of Bronte? <laughs> Who's asking? Me. I'm asking. No, leave it, Fred. What do you mean, leave it? Look, I don't know what business you in, but leave it, Fred. You and your pal that was in here before. Oh. That dude's quite interested who was at the bar. Also, if an old black dude... Oh, here we go. An old black dude tells you to leave it. I could leave it. There's an Italian spaghetti eating long streak of piss big. It yes. makes my skin crawl. I'm so squally a cocksucker. You know what I mean, friend? Where can I find him? Oh, well, I reckon you talk to them kids in the alley. They'll know I get. Uh, okay, thank oh, you. Hey, friend, you'll be careful now. Immigrants, they're not to be trusted. If you're a fucking immigrant, you complete twit. Unless you're telling me that you're now Sioux Indian or some shit. <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> fucking hell. Uh, right. Down here? This feels like I'm about to get mugged. <laughs> Come on now, this oh. fucking doesn't become you. Oh. You always have to be right, don't you? Pardon me, but have you seen any kids around this way? Yeah, I think I heard a few in the other courtyard up ahead. You can get through on the left there. Oh, thank you. It's like, have I just interrupted a domestic? So are you done with the silent treatment now? No. No! Jesus. All right. Children? Oh, hang on. Children. Cleat. Hey. Hey, you got a cigarette, mister? Maybe. Huh? I'm looking Maybe. for a fellow named Angelo Bronte. Italian. I know him. Everyone knows him. Where is he? We'll take you to him. What it'll cost. Dude, be careful. I reckon I can pay. Five dollars. Where's he live? New York? I'm an entrepreneur. If you don't want to pay, then I don't want to walk. Oh, man. Bread. Here. Come on. This away. Let's go, mister. You coming, Cleet? He's so Italian. Close. Easy to get lost around here. Oh, God. Come on, then. This is a scam. Are you new to the city, mister? Pretty much. Don't worry. No one knows it as good as me and Cleet. Is that right? That's what worries Hope you me. You won't need his services, but you got the doctor on the corner there. Nice enough, fella. That's Baird and Schreiber on the right there. Famous bookstore. Not that I'm much of a reader myself. Now, oh, over here's a real piece of art. That's the Church of the Holy Blessed Whoop. Virgin, mister. Model on the famous church in Toulouse, which is in France. Oh, I You've can been see to it. Toulouse, mister? No. We're Catholics here, mister. Ain't Baptist or nothing. My mama said they used to burn Protestants and all, but, uh... Bet they don't have nothing so fine where you come from, mister. Look at them fine Oi! steeples. Oi! True little shits! Get going! He's coming after us! Stop, God damn it. Holy fuck! I've been scabbed! We knew it. We knew it was gonna happen. Give me my fucking lasso. No! You little shit! Has he taken my $2,400? This, this child will not live. George is slightly too far away as well to call, I think. At the time that it would take, it would get away. You better stop right now. It's a good thing I'm underfed, because apparently my stamina's better or something. Fuck knows. Fucking Oliver Twist. Shit. Oh, thanks, random dude. Thanks for the help, friend. Where'd he go? Hey, Mister, you seen a boy running through here? I haven't. No. You little fuck. I'm gonna get scammed again trying to find him. Don't mind me. I'm just having a drink. Jets are bad. Oh no. Oh. Some much. Couldn't even 
Hello. Hey, you see a kid about 14 years old run through here? Why, yes, we did. He went around the corner there. Oh, cool. Thanks. Oh, you little shit. I can't. Oh. Couldn't run then. Oh, my God. Excuse me. Bam! Oh, you little fuck. You little shit. Ah! Oh, hello. Sorry, madam. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Do not make me shoot you, child. Am I? Come here! Hello? I can't get out. Oh, God, that was slow. You ain't got a chance in hell. You sure? Oh, that's not him. The aiming has gone very unhelpful right now. Oh no, I fell down and hurt myself. What a fucking shame. I like how he's waiting. It's very... Are you kidding me? So you, you actually can't lasso him. Which is very helpful. Which makes it very obvious that we're being uh, led down a magical... Maybe mugging sort of thing. I don't know. I mean, they've already mugged me. Oh, you little bastard. He's probably gone to the fence, hasn't he? Morning, mister. Hi. Morning, Hi there, ma'am. Hello. Hello. I'm telling you, a cucumber's definitely Careful. fruit. Stands for dangerous folk around here. <laughs> I read it in the newspaper. Yes. Oh, God, where is he? Fuck it is! Come <laughs> Oh! On, you little like shit! Ah. Why is it always children? Why? Come here! Oh, oh What's shit. The problem, shit, shit. Fuck. Bollocks. Give me my thanks, boy. What are you talking about, friend? I ain't your friend. But that kid is, and he robbed from me. Now give me back my stuff and take me to Angelo Bronte. Senor Bronte. That kid was gonna show me before he robbed me. Now, come on. You new in town, mister? Come on. Mr. Bronte's got a lot of friends, mister, but... Don't make me shoot you all. I ain't never seen you. We ain't friends. You don't like no one, mister. Mr. Bronte, he's got fine hair. He got a beautiful house, and I am proud to work for him. He got 50 men, mister. Why are you gonna care a thing about you? I just wanna speak with him. <laughs> I'm sure you do, mister. You and them friends of yours been asking about him all over town. Oh. Keeping mighty disrespected. Bunch of muddy Yankees in town asking questions. Well, you and your friend should pay him a visit, mister. He's got a big house on Flavian Street opposite the park. Ah, Hey, thanks. yokel. Oh. Now, get out of here. What the fuck? Was that it? Oh, I got my, all my money back. I, was a, I get that that was a way to send a message, lads, but very long-winded. You could have literally just had a little chat excuse with me. You. No, excuse you, madam. 